Beep Beep, Canada's largest RV show has arrived at the International Centre in Mississauga and it's staying parked here until Sunday. Now, if you're in the market for a new RV, well, there's 450 models inside the venue to get an up-close look at. Something for everybody's style and budget. So if you're a fan of road trips, camping and outdoor adventures, well, this is the event for you. Joining us from the Canadian Recreational Vehicle Association is Shane Devonish. And wow, it must feel like the holidays, like Christmas for you being here right now. <laughs> well, a lot of uh, a lot of work goes into uh, putting this show together, and uh, we're really excited about how things look. Well, so excited to be here because it is absolutely magical and marvelous to see all these RVs here. So this show is known as the big one, but this is really just a small sampling of what people can expect. You know, when they're camping, when they're going out on the roads. Yeah. So you know, uh, there's about a million uh, RVs out in the road in Canada. About 14 percent of Canadian households own an RV, so it's a very big industry and uh, what we try to do as an association is is demonstrate the entirety of the industry by having every mo uh, model uh, here uh, at, for any budget yeah and what can people expect when they come to the show they can expect a lot of RVs, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> number one, but they also can expect uh, a, a lot of learning. Um, we have seminars in three different areas going on throughout the show. We have uh, a, a 15,000 square foot camper marketplace for all your parts and accessories. Um, but, you know, just to wander and learn. But it is uh, known as the best uh, show to buy t uh, from. So uh, definitely, uh, you know, dealers put on, you know, their best face and uh, this is a show to buy. Well, and honestly, when you think RVs, when you think of uh, recreational vehicles, there so, sometimes if you're not experienced or you haven't seen a whole lot, there's a very specific view of what an RV is like. But coming here, it is absolutely gorgeous. And so take me through some of the design trends. So, so what can people expect when they come here? Yeah, so the future of the RV business uh, isn't quite here yet, but we're working on it quickly. It's going to be EV uh, friendly. Uh, there's going to be lithium batteries, uh, you know, etc. But for now, most of the manufacturers are building uh, solar capabilities, so people can go out in the middle of nowhere and and park an RV and still use their appliances and and still have hot water and their shower and all that. So that's kind of the trend. So what people can see here. Is a lot of solar uh, technology yeah and honestly it some of the rvs here i'm just thinking this is way nicer than my apartment to, to be honest just that, that's just how beautiful things are here now in addition to the rvs that they'll check out here there's also a marketplace as well uh so in terms of the marketplace so w what are we finding there yeah so we've got uh, about uh, about 40 vendors in there including a uh, thousand islands rv uh, for their uh, parts store so you know you can come here and get a great deal on your parts and accessories but also you can find some some uh, solar panel uh, uh, manufacturers and their, uh, you know, uh, TV, uh, you know, out in the wild suppliers. But there's a wide variety of anything camping related in there. Yeah, and also it's for kids as well. So I know that it seems like very parents focus or adult focus, but this is going to be a family event for whoever comes in today or tomorrow or into Sunday as well. Well. RVing is family quality time. So we want to put in uh, some uh, features in here for kids. We have a face painter, we have a coloring contest, we have live entertainment for the adults, including some adult beverages back there where you can sit and relax and watch your kids get your face painted. We have Santa here actually, who's wandering around the show. So if you want a picture with Santa, he's here with uh, with one of his sidekicks. So there's, uh, there's something for everybody in the yeah. family. And well, ticket prices of uh, ticket not ticket prices, but ticket demand has gone up three hundred percent. And I think, uh, especially with the last couple of years, a lot of people have been embracing nature a lot more and being out on the road. For you personally, uh, what is it about the RV experience and the experience of going outdoors that makes it special to you? You know, especially uh, what we've seen in the last three years, COVID, and it's put a lot of stress on everybody. And to be able to get outdoors and just to relax, maybe no Wi-Fi, you know, you're not checking uh, your email so much, but you just get downtime. 
Everybody needs downtime for their mental well-being, and that's what we've seen in the last three years. Yeah, and you even have a family that's going to be coming in just to share their experience because, you know, they're not living in a conventional home. They've chosen to take their entire family, kids and dog included, uh, out in nature as well. Yeah, so, you know, it's a traveling family. It's traveled right across Canada in their RV, excited to hear their story. Um, they came here three years ago, bought an RV, and uh, now they're ready wow. to tell the story about it. So, Well, plenty to see, plenty to hear. Uh, Shane Devonish from the Canadian Recreational Vehicle Association, thank you so much. Enjoy your weekend here. And if you want tickets and more details on how you can head on down, well, you know, just head online, TorontoSpringCampingRVShow.com for more information.